Okay, magandang araw muli sa inyong lahat. Welcome sa ating channel, Sir Lopez Live. At sa araw na ito ay magkakaroon muli tayo ng self-evaluation dito sa subject na Vice and Drug Education and Control. Subject ito ng mga third year na naka-enroll sa kursong Criminology. Okay, so ang mga kasagutan dito ay makikita lamang sa ating description box. Okay, so start na natin sa question Number one, a substance used as medicine or in the making of medicines which affects the body and mind and have great potential for abuse. Letter A, solvent. Letter B, drugs. Letter C, shabu. Or letter D, medicine. Question number two. Amount of drug that produces untoward effects or symptoms of poisoning. Letter A, minimal dose. Letter B, maximal dose. Letter C, toxic dose. Or letter D, overdose. Number three. Common method of administering drugs offering the fastest response or effect. Letter A, oral. Letter B, injection. Letter C, inhalation. Or letter D, topical. Number four. What kind of drug is usually called miracle drug? drug. Letter A, morphine. Letter B, marijuana. Letter C, shabu. Or letter D, heroin. Number 5. What country is usually referring to as drug paradise in Asia? A, Lebanon. B, China. C, U.S. or letter D, Philippines. Number six. The world's oldest cultivated plant, source of dangerous drugs. It was cultivated by the Incas of Peru. It was used by the Assyrians in 9000 BC in the religious rituals and was called sacred tree. Letter A, opium poppy. Letter B, marijuana. Letter C, codin. Or letter D, morphine. Number seven. Refers to the individual reaction to drug for unexplained reasons. Letter A, idiosyncrasy. Letter B, allergy. Letter C, side effects. Or letter D, drug abuse. Number 8, a place where any dangerous drug and or control precursor, an essential chemical is administered, delivered, is stored for illegal purposes, distributed, sold, or used in any form. Letter A, then, letter B, dive, letter C, resort, or letter D, all of them. Number 9, the tendency to increase the dose of drug to produce the same or desired effect. Letter A, addiction. Letter B, drug dependence. Letter C, tolerance. Or letter D, drug craving. Number 10, are commercially produced drugs that may be purchased legally without prescription. These drugs are also known as property drugs. A. Over-the-counter drugs. B. Prescription drugs. Letter C. 
unrecognized drugs or letter D, herbal drugs. Number 11. Commercial products that have a psychoactive drug effect but are not usually considered drugs. These substances are not generally regulated by law except in so far as standards of sanitation and purity is required. Letter A, over-the-counter drugs. Letter B, prescription drugs. Letter C, unrecognized drugs. Or letter D, herbal drugs. Number 12. Alcohol and tobacco are some examples of these drugs. Letter A, over-the-counter drugs. Letter B, prescription drugs. Letter C, unrecognized drugs. Or letter D, herbal drugs. Number 13, drugs which produce sensitivity. I repeat number 13. Drugs which produce insensitivity, stupor, melancholy, or dullness of mind with delusions. Letter A, hallucinogens. Letter B, depressants. Letter C, stimulants. Or letter D, narcotics. 14. Are drugs which decrease or depress body functions and nerves activity. This group includes sedatives, hypnotics, and tranquilizers. A. Hallucinogens. B. Depressants. C. Stimulants or letter D. Narcotics. 15. Are drugs which increase alertness, reduce hunger, and provide the feeling of well-being. Letter A, hallucinogens. Letter B, depressants. Letter C, stimulants. Or letter D, narcotics. 16. Opium, heroin, codeine. Morphine are the most popular in this pharmacological classification of drugs. A. Hallucinogens. B. Depressants. C. Stimulants. Or letter D. Narcotics. 17. Where drug is taken under circumstances, and at a dose that significantly increases their hazard or potential, whether or not used therapeutically. A. Drug abuse. B. Drug misuse. C. Drug use. Or letter D. Drug overuse. 18. It is a state of psychic or physical dependence or both on drug arising in a person following administration of drug on a periodic or continuous basis. A. Drug dependence. B. Drug abuse. C. Drug misuse. Or letter D. Drug use. Nineteen. A state of periodic or chronic intoxication produced by the repeated consumption of a drug, natural or synthetic. Letter A, drug addiction. B, drug dependence. Letter C, drug abuse. Or letter D, drug misuse. 20. A cluster of characteristic reactions and behavior of varying intensity, depending on the amount of the drug taken and length of time use, which ensue upon abrupt cessation of drug upon the body has potential dependence. A. Sociological symptoms. B. 
withdrawal symptoms, letter C, mysterious symptoms, or letter D, drug symptoms. 21. Models of drug abuse prevention, except letter A, drug trafficking model, letter B, education model, letter C, medical model, or letter D, law enforcement model. 22. A form of entrapment employed by law enforcers of, I repeat, a form of entrapment employed by law enforcers as an effective way of apprehending a criminal in the act of the commission of the offense. A. Bypass operation. B. Search and seizure strategy. Letter C. Mobile checkpoint operation. Or letter D. All of them. 23. An act instituting the Comprehensive Dangerous Drugs Act of 2002, Repealing Republic Act 6425, otherwise known as the Dangerous Drug of 1972 as amended, providing funds therefore and for other purpose. Letter A. RA-9165, letter B, RA-6425, letter C, RA-6591, or letter D, RA-1695. Any act of knowingly passing a dangerous drug to another, personally or otherwise, and by any means, with or without consideration. A. Deliver. B. Drug dependence. Letter C. Dispense. Or letter D. All of them. Next, 25. Any organized group of two or more persons forming, forming or joining together with the intention of committing any offense prescribed under this act. Letter A, Drug Brotherhood. Letter B, Drug Syndicate. Letter C, Drug Dependence. Or Letter D, Illegal Trafficking. Okay, so good luck sa inyo. Uh, mangyari lamang na uh, sagutan na ang mga sumusunod na katanungan at tignan nyo na rin kung ilan ang inyong nakuha base sa Kato Correction na makikita dito sa ating description box. Okay, so hanggang sa muli, maraming salamat at magandang araw po sa inyong lahat.